All right, in today's tutorial, you're first going to log into your Google Drive and you're going to download your pictures from your digital story folder in your Google Drive. So, to so the first thing you need to do is select all of your pictures by either dragging a box over all of the pictures so that they highlight in blue, meaning that they've been selected, all of them have been selected, or on your keyboard you could press Command A. I think that's the easiest way. Hold down the Control key on your keyboard, which is in the bottom left corner and the bottom right corner. There are two of them in the same row as the space bar, bottom left, bottom right. Hold down the Control key, click on it, let go of the Control key when this window shows up, go to download, click on it, and it will zip up the files, put them into one little folder, and download it to the computer from your Google Drive. Once it is done, you will notice here in the downloads area of the dock, it will bounce just like it's showing. Click on it so that this expands outward. Click on that zip file and drag it to the desktop. Double click on it and it will open and create a folder. You now no longer need this zip file. Drag it to the trash. All of your pictures are now on the computer in this folder on the desktop. I'm going to go ahead and get Google Drive minimized and put into the dock to get it out of the way. Double click on the folder. You can then see your pictures. Put your folder of pictures on one side of the screen. Leave it there for a moment. We're now going to start using the Apple application or app called Photos, which is a white circle with a rainbow flower in it. Click on it. It will bounce. Once it opens, what you want to do is go right here to this plus button, click on it, go to Album. We're going to create a new album, so leave this alone, but right here it says Album Name. Type in your class number, either 81 or 82. I'm going to do, I'm going to do 8-1 and put in your last name. This will be your album for your pictures for your project. Click OK. Click in the top right corner, click the blue continue button. Now, you'll notice that your class number and last name is in the top left corner. This is your photo album. Go over here and click in this window. Do a command A, which selects all of the pictures. Then click, hold, and drag. Drop it, drop it into your album. Here's what you're going to do. Now you should have more than 15 pictures, but for the sake of the argument, now what you're going to do is you're going to, now what you need to do is sequence your pictures. Whichever picture is going to be your first picture in your story should sit in this position. So the order should go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and so on. So if this is your first picture, you pick it up and you drag it to the first position. If this is your second picture, you drag this to the second position, one, two, three, and so on. This is how you sequence your pictures, getting it ready to be used in the application called iMovie, where we make our film.